Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. In this video we are going to review an Android Box TV. So the model is A5X Max. Inputs and outputs. And inside the box we can find the power adapter, remote control, HDMI cable, and Android TV user manual. Regarding the box itself, all details in the video description. This box was brought to me by GearBest, so thank you GearBest. Link to buy this box also in the video description, so go there if you are interested. Oh, okay, the looks is really nice. already with the USB 3.0 ok let's boot for the first time Okay, the setup is really easy, so select the language, in this case I will select English. It is to set up the, the screen, it's correct, so next. Now the Wi-Fi, it detects two networks in my house. So I'm going to select this one, enter the password. Okay next so this will be our main screen this is a description <laughs> this is the, the description about the remote control and this is the launcher so in the middle the icons you cannot change and below the last use it apps and these are all the apps that comes with the with your machine so mob draw already installed it Netflix YouTube Google Play Store Let's have a look at the settings connected by HDMI the storage this is the 16 version and now the Android version set 7.1 which is Noga
Okay, let's let's have a look at CPU Z to, to see the hardware details. And as you can see, it's rooted. This box is already rooted. Let's go now to Antutu Benchmark. And this is the score achieved by the A5X Max. for the CPU, for the GPU, okay. Once again, the details about the machine. And the last one will be Geekbench 4. Okay, this is the final result. Let's do the video testing now with Cody. So let's start by 1080p, 30 frames per second. No problems whatsoever. Ten eighty P sixty frames. No issues, really nice. Four K thirty frames per second. Also perfect, no issues. And 4K 60 frames per second. And with this one, it's not working properly. So the box is struggling to play this video. So 4K 60 frames per second. 
it's not powerful enough to play the video. Let's test again 30 frames per second. No problems. And 60 frames per second. No. No, no, no. Okay, let's start. Let's test now H265. Okay, no issues for this one. Also no issues, 1080p. No issues, 4K. This is playing from, from a USB pin drive. 4K 200 Okay, problems again Don't, It doesn't seem to be smooth No And the next one 400 4K It's a no It doesn't handle this kind of Codec and this compression. Let's try another one. And with this one, no problems at all. Twenty four frames, H two six five. So it depends on the codec. So the box is able to play 4K, but it depends on the codec applied to the file. No problems whatsoever to play 1080p. For 4K. it seems to to have problems with certain files okay so this is the temperature and this is this was for video testing let's try now some games As you can see, running good, no issues. Although this is a simple graphic game. No lag, everything playing perfectly. Okay, let's try another one. And as you can see for gaming, this box it's really really nice.
so don't forget if you like the video if you want to see more videos like this please give the video a thumbs up subscribe the channel for more videos and leave your comment below all details about the box in the video description this video was brought brought to us by gear best thank you and see you on the next video